All right, day one starts with us getting through the access panels. We're still looking to see kind of what was going on with the fuel tanks. They were leaking real bad, so we're kind of doing a little assessment with that. Then we move down to the strut. I'm gonna start loosening those up, leave the bolts in so nothing can happen. Go up to the top bolts, get those loose, kind of leave them in just as much. And then we're taking out that second bolt. Move inside, take the flapper on, bolt off. Then we move to the jury struts here, get those bolts fully out. Then we'll move back up to the wing here and get the full strut bolts out fully. And then move down to the bottom ones because they'll just the wing is just laying on that ladder right now. Then I can just pull the bolts out, lift up on the strut unit itself, and pull it out and put it in the truck. And now we'll take the front bolt out, which is the only thing holding it. And there it goes. It swings down on that nice little swing. All right. So we got the wings taken down. They're on these hinges that slide out. And so we can bring them back and lock them. So we're going to lock them with some uh, ratchet straps and some foam pieces in between. Uh, back here and I'll tell you what for for everything that I've heard of everyone saying that this isn't worth it uh, honestly I actually do think it's worth it and I'll tell you why because I was able to sit here and do it by myself if I wasn't by myself I would have not been able to get this wing to the ground by myself because it's it's pretty heavy it's very cumbersome uh, and things like that plus we're sitting here getting able to really look and see kind of what was going on in the, the fuel tanks the leak uh, also the drain on the other side was draining out directly into the wing this right here i don't like that it just drains into there well we came to bring some tools back to d2 and it's looking like that storm is finally getting here looks like the bottom is about to drop out so we're gonna have to call it a night d2 i guess i'll keep these till in the morning so we'll get some stuff figured out and uh, get it loaded and head out in the morning, I guess. We definitely can't fly, so and that looks really bad right through there. Doesn't look like we're gonna make it out tonight. So what we'll do is we'll get over, probably hunker down and kind of go from there. I need to catch that guy and give him these tools. So everything's squared away, wings are ready to go. This thing's ready to be loaded up on the trailer. We'll get to it in the morning. Let these storms pass and we'll get out of here. So hopefully you're following your passions and dreams in aviation. This is day one on the Apex build.